Hello and welcome to What's New in Golan 2023.3. The new AI assistant is coming in swinging, and there is a lovely little number of Go updates and quality of life improvements. So, what are you waiting for? Let's get going. The AI assistant is arriving just in time for the holidays. With features such as refactoring code and placing those improvements directly into the editor, there is a whole plethora of possibilities that have just been unlocked. However, there are way too many cool things to explore in this one video, so we've created some content specifically to go in-depth about this new feature. Next, here are some fun gopherific improvements. You can now generate a switch case for enums. Parameter information is shown in slice expressions. Folding has now been improved for error returns and panics. I find this much more readable. A quick fix has been added for creating a function in another package. And finally, we now support local Go installations with ASDF. Our inbuilt HTTP client has a couple of new features as well. The new structure view now helps to make navigation smoother in large HTTP files. All you need to do is click and you'll be moving around with ease. And you can now declare variables in HTTP files. If you're a fan of our inbuilt version control tooling, it just got an upgrade. With the all-in-one diff viewer, instead of going through differences file by file, one by one, you can now do it all in one. I love when things just explain themselves. Oh, and one extra thing before we wrap. If you've ever wanted to color coordinate your tabs to match your project view, well, the future is now. And with that, we're coming to a close, but I do have a slight confession. There's loads, and I mean loads more, that is featured inside the official release blog, and the link will be just below in the description. So, which feature was most exciting, and which feature would you like to see in future? Please, as always, let us know in the comments below, and until next time, get out there and go get creative.